Hi everyone, this is M.A. Today I'm going to show you how to crochet the berry stitch. So let's get started. I post videos on Tuesdays and Fridays. You can slow down the videos by clicking the gear icon below the video. I'm working with worsted weight yarn and a 6 millimeter crochet hook. Start with a slip knot. and work a foundation chain in an even number. For washcloth, start with chain 22, single crochet in the second stitch from the hook, and in each stitch all the way across the chain. To make a single crochet, insert the hook into the stitch, pick up the yarn and pull it through. Pick up the yarn and pull it through the two loops on the hook. Single crochet. Go ahead and single crochet in each stitch all the way across the row. All the way across the row. Okay, I worked all the way across the row. Now I'm going to chain one and turn, and I'm going to single crochet in that very first stitch. And in the next stitch, I'm going to make my berry stitch. So we yarn around the hook, insert into the stitch, pick up the yarn and pull it through, pick up the yarn, pull it through one loop. You're going to have three loops on your hook. Yarn around the hook, insert into the stitch, pick up the yarn and pull it through, we're going to have one, two, three, four, five loops on the hook. Pick up the yarn, pull it through all five loops. Single crochet in the next stitch. Berry stitch in the next stitch. Yarn around the hook, insert into the stitch, pick up the yarn and pull it through. Pick up the yarn, pull it through one loop. Yarn around the hook, insert into the stitch, Pick up the yarn and pull it through. One, two, three, four, five loops on the hook. Pick up the yarn, pull it through all five loops. Single crochet in the next stitch. And the berry stitch is forming on the other side. So I'm going to work across the row. Berry stitch in the next stitch. I've yarned around the hook. Insert into the stitch. Pick up the yarn and pull it through. Pick up the yarn, pull it through one loop, one, two, three, yarn around the hook, insert into the stitch, pick up the yarn and pull it through, one, two, three, four, five, pull through all five loops, single crochet in the next stitch. Repeat all the way across the row. Okay, I worked all the way across the row. I ended with a single crochet. And that's what that looks like on the other side. Now for the next row, I'm going to chain one and turn. Single crochet in that very first stitch. And in each stitch all the way across the row. Single crochet. All the way across the row. Okay, I worked all the way across the row making my single crochet row. And this is just a two row repeat. It's one row of single crochet, one row of berry stitch. So chain one and turn, single crochet in that very first stitch, make a berry stitch in the next stitch. One, two, three, four, five, single crochet in the next, berry stitch in the next, single crochet, like that, and just continue to repeat those two rows. And it has this nice bubbly texture from the outside and there's what it looks like on the inside.
and you can use the stitch to make washcloths. For a washcloth, start with chain 22, or a baby hat, or blankets, scarves, bags, or pillows. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.